I wanted to make a video to show how you can easily make a hydrogen and oxygen gas producing machine system just by using these fire extinguishers. Uh, I'm not sure how many people are familiar with these, but yeah, you can um, you can take this cap off and you can put water inside the tank, and then right here you can fill it with air, and um, once you do that, then you can kind of use it as a fire extinguisher like this so it's it's a reusable fire extinguisher but uh, what, what we're gonna do though is instead of using it as a fire extinguisher what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the down stem and we're gonna replace it with a metal one like this and then we're gonna isolate the down stem from the tank Once the down stem is isolated from the tank, then we can connect a positive or negative electrode to the handle here, and a positive or negative electrode to the tank handle here. Then electrolysis will be performed inside the tank. That way you don't have to worry about transferring the gas anywhere. The uh, hydrogen and oxygen will get captured right inside the tank. The tank itself will be one electrode and the down stem will be the other. And uh, yeah, then uh, we'll just have to start doing some testing to see um, to see how much water and how much uh, gas you can get in there. And uh, you can also use the, the gauge here to see how much pressure you build inside the tank. Because the, the key is to capture the gases inside the tank and to perform electrolysis inside the tank. Uh, once uh, you can do that with an air sight, uh, air uh, sealed, airtight seal, then, um, then you can transport the gas or you can uh, store it or then you can uh, plan, on, uh, plan on consuming it somehow. I would advise not using a this as a fire extinguisher after you do that like fill it with hydrogen and oxygen and gas and then spray it out with this and then ignite the like this is not a a recipe for a flamethrower or uh or for a bomb but uh this can be very potentially dangerous if uh if you have a bunch of hydrogen and oxygen gas in here and you uh ignite it so just a little safety tip there if you do happen to build one of these and you fill the tank with uh, oxygen and hydrogen, um, be cautious if you uh, decide to ignite it. Could explode on you. Alright, that's my safety tip and uh, let's go ahead and start building. 